Okay, so this is a 190D. I'm gonna get out so you can take a look. It's uh, it's pretty clean. I mean, I haven't cleaned the inside, but the outside has had new paint. And, um, you know, it's fairly nice. Uh, they said they spent, this is the prior owner said they spent $1,200 having it painted. So, um, the engine, again, I haven't cleaned it. I've got a can of uh, degreaser and I could clean it up, but um, it's just a trooper. It just goes on. I changed the oil every 3,000. I've had the car just over, um, oh, I would say uh, a year and a half, 18 months. And um, had no trouble with it. I've got a, a new battery on it. It's got really good compression. I know that because it starts cold uh, easily. So here's the other side. And uh, it's going to need a couple of tires. I actually have some tires that will go with it, uh, which are okay. They're not. Here it is. So it's registered to March 2013. And like I said, you should really look at some others, but this is a, a good uh, original car uh, and low low miles on the engine. Uh, let me see if I can, I don't know if you'll be able to read that, but there you go. It says it's uh, 0185, so it's an 85. Okay, I'm gonna start her up so you can. <clears throat> now it has been well, it's been about two hours ago I took it for a drive, so um, it's warm. But it wouldn't matter if it's cold on a cold day. It'll just start straight away, so... Here you go. Got the sensor on here for the thing. And it's straight on. And you'll see once the oil pressure goes, there it is, full three bar. I need to get some gas. I'm on a hill, but I do need to get some diesel. Um, there's the light there. You can see it's on. Like I said, it may be a wire, I doubt it though. It's actually in the oil pan. It's something that a uh, mechanic or an amateur mechanic could probably do quite easily. Uh, I just didn't bother doing it because I could see, like I said, that it, I know how it works and it's got three bar of pressure. Um, what else? It's a bit grubby inside. That's because I live on a dirt road. You can see, I mean, everything's here. It just needs a good clean. And the inside is, uh, I took some of these switches out. The driver's side door goes up and down. The other switches need cleaning. Again, that's common problems with the uh, the old Benzes. Uh, it's got a little tiny, I don't even see that, a little tiny star in the windshield, but it's not cracked. Um, that's what the engine sounds like. Uh, I go around clean and straight and looks nice I and mean, certainly very presentable and this is uh, I've had two of these 190Ds and I've had two 300Ds and I've had a TD wagon two TD wagons one 300D two wagons um, and it's a pretty nice car like I said I mean I I've had it about 18 months I've probably done nine ten thousand miles it's not uh, my primary car, but it's the kind of car you can just jump in. It's great gas mileage, and uh, you can jump in today and go go to LA, easy, from Northern California. Okay, so um, that's it. Uh, let me look in the back. Say so everything is there. It's a black interior. Um, gold, metallic gold paint, and it's newer paint, so it's pretty nice. And that's about it, just a, a wash, and uh, I put it through the car wash, but it just needs a little love. But it's uh, certainly nothing wrong with it. Okay, enjoy. Thank you.